guys okay so i'm going to show you how to run mturk off of your phone um i don't really recommend it for the only way that you do mturk because it is a lot less efficient and it can be a little bit more iffy uh, on getting good hits from good requesters but you can do it if you don't have a laptop or the only time that you have is on your phone or a tablet so uh the first thing you want to do is you can have three main pages open so just go to whatever your internet thing is uh so i'm going to open a new tab the first tab you want to have open is to mturk.com so it's going to work the same way as it does on your laptop so you just sign in as worker um i already have it filtered out so you're just going to want to hit hits on qualified for i'm going to show you how to do batches first so hits most first and then starting at one penny um i usually don't do one penny hits but there are a few to where they literally just take as quickly as your uh internet can load it and that's how quickly you can do it so sometimes the one cent hits are actually really worthwhile so i always just kind of keep a lookout for those so we're going to get hit apply. So the second thing you're going to want to do is open Turk Opticon. So I'm just going to show you all how to do that. I'm already there. Turk Opticon. So this is the website for the script that uh, you use on your laptop. And this is where they get all their information from. So Turk Opticon, uh, when you look it up, it should be the first one. It's going to have an EDU address. So we're going to click on that. Um, internet's being slow for some reason. Close. So, uh, you're not going to be able to search unless you sign up using the email. Uh, I just use this email that I have on my uh, YouTube page. Um, it's not really hard to do. I don't, I'm not even going to verify it. So now let's go back to MTurk. So keep this tab open to Turk Opticon. You can just sign up. There'll be a little thing that says login. Click on login and it'll ask you to sign up. So now we're going to go back to MTurk. So now that I'm here and I'm looking at batches, I'm going to look and see which ones I want to do. So let's see here. Do I want to classify receipts? Okay. All right. I might want to do that. So you look at the requester name. So it's that name on the left in blue. So since you don't have Turk Opticon, since you're not on a website, like a laptop, you're going to have to go to the actual website. So what you do is just hit your tab, Turk Opticon, and search the name. So... We're going to see if this is even worth doing. We're going to take a quick look at the review. So this one is called Scout It. So we're going to go right here to the search bar. Scout It. Hit search. I guess I didn't put that name in there the same way it is. So, hmm. That's not how the name looks on there. Let me go back and double check. It's all one word, so let's try it in one word. There you go. So this is going to give you all the information about the scouted requester. So there's going to be a bunch, a bunch of reviews about just about any requester. Uh, some of the newer ones don't have reviews. So you can either go through and look at them, which would take a lot of time, or you can kind of just do a really quick overview of it. So there is quite a bit of green, uh, but it's mostly red. So I wouldn't really do this one given the pay of it and given that there are so many red on the fairness. So uh, sometimes the pay can be red and it's still okay. I'm not really concerned with the communication because that's only if you want to talk to them and get some kind of question answered. I'm mostly concerned with the fairness. And so there are a lot, a lot of redness on here. So you just take a quick look at it and it's like, well, I don't think I want to do this one. So we're going to go back here and try to find a different one. So 10 second iPhone survey USA. So uh, usually surveys are pretty good. Um, most of the people that do surveys are colleges, sometimes businesses, and they usually accept people as long as you um, follow the instructions pretty closely. You can mess up a little bit. So we're just going to look up these guys just in case, just to kind of get y'all used to it. And when you're doing this and you're not talking, um, you will go a lot quicker. when your internet isn't awful <sighs> okay research studies baruch i uh, don't think that's them consumer research studies consumer research studies consumer research studies so i don't think these people have any information on there so we're gonna keep looking complete a behavioral survey so let's try this one so this is a batch Generate queries within a catalog, clink dev. So we're going to go here and you need to make sure that you type it just exactly how it looks on the MTurk. So 
So we're going to go to quick. All right, so this one is red, but it's only on the pay. Five quarries for only 12 cents is not worth it. The rest of them are really good. So I don't really pay attention if the majority are that good. I don't pay attention to one bad review. So we're going to go ahead and do this. So now that we found one that we want to do, you just hit accept. Now there are a couple ways that you can do this. Um, you can work off of this page just like this by hitting auto accept. So I'm going to run through that really quick. Um, I do these particular hits quite often. Um, and we're going to run through it really quick. I'm only going to fill out one and then uh, kind of put pause and then show y'all what happens after. So I had asked the chatbot about the types of checking accounts. Do you offer dividends on your checking accounts? What checking accounts do you have? Do you have a checking account that meets my needs? Do you have more than one? So this one is just rewarding the reward rewarding the same sentence in a different way. So I'm gonna hit pause. Okay, so I filled all these out. So if you want to work directly off of here, I don't know why this is not. I don't know. Okay, so if you want to work directly off of here, you can just hit auto accept next hit and that will do it for you. So I'm going to work off of here one time and show you. So now that I submitted it, uh, it's going to automatically give me another one. So another way that you can do this is you can, if there are batches and you want to do a whole bunch, oh shoot. So you can hit accept. Make sure that's not turned on. Go back. Hit accept. Go back. So you're just going to build up a bunch of them that you can do. And then I'm going to show you where you go once you get a whole bunch of them to do. So I got three right now. So I got three. So now that I have, uh, usually I would do a whole lot more because I really like those hits and they're really good ones. So then you just go up here, hit your little tab and go to your hits queue. So what that is, and um, it's the same thing as it is on the laptop, it's just the place where all the hits that you have picked up are going to be at. And you can work directly off of there. So then you just hit work. I'm going to answer one, then hit pause and show you what happens next. So how do I reset my call 24 pin? I need a new call 20. Okay, so I finished all this one, so I'm just going to hit submit, and it's automatically going to take me to the next hit in my queue. So uh, one reason that I like working off of my hits queue is if I'm snagging a lot of hits uh, on the computer, um, you can work off of here, and it'll show you the ones that you have to do first before the time runs out. It also works the same on the phone, so if you're getting a bunch of hits, you're looking around, it'll hit you with the ones that you need to finish first. So it's going to keep going and you're just going to work off of your hits queue and then when you're done, you can either go get more of the same hit or you can go get different hits. So I'm going to hit pause and finish these because I really like them. Okay, so I finished all of them and it popped me right back here. So that's kind of the best way to do it. Um, you can also filter it out for surveys too. Um, so we're going to go here and we're going to go reward amount highest first. Apply. Apply. And then I'm also going to look just for surveys. So the search bar is a little bit different on here, but uh, it's still pretty similar. So take a one to two minute survey to qualify. Okay, so we're just going to do this. I do recommend that sometimes you just take your time and go through and try to find qualifications. Um, but I made a video on that and that'll kind of help you guys. <sighs> okay, so we're going to look Brian Brown right here. Brian Brown. So this one's not bad. Communication is the worst thing. The pay is the worst thing. This one said an unpaid screener. Um, I do recommend that sometimes you do take the unpaid screeners if they're a qualification for a bigger hit because they're going to allow you to get more hits. So this is a good one to do really quick. It's actually kind of good to get a qualification that actually pays. Okay, so it's really important when you are doing, especially when you're doing surveys on your phone, but even on your laptop, is that when you see this hyperlink that you open it in a new tab. 
So you want to keep this tab that has the actual hit that you're working on open. So I hit, I just held down on it hard and then opened in a new tab. So now we're going to go over here. University of Texas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think anybody ever reads this. Sure, I'll participate. What color is the sky? I'm just saying what color the sky is. Guess I messed that one up. Anyways, um, what the heck? That's weird. Okay, so we're just going to return that. Okay, so that's how you do that. So the other way that you can work um, hit is to utilize Reddit. You can make a Reddit account. You don't have to be active on it. Uh, but Reddit has a lot, a lot of stuff for MDIRK. I have the Reddit app, but we're just going to work off of the website. So Reddit has a really active MDIRK community, and they can be really helpful. They have two main threads on here. They have MTurk, uh, which is going to give you a lot of information about MTurk. They're going to have the frequently asked questions thing. And then there's also hits worth tur turking for. So you see there's 42,401 followers. Um, a lot of people get on here and they put on tur uh, hits from MTurk that are good just to help people out. So the best way to do it on here is to go new because a lot of the hits will be dead. So they're going to automatically give you information like this one's dead. Answer survey on choices about financial products equals. So we're going to see this. Not now. Okay. So we're going to open the hyperlink because you want to keep this open to Reddit. And we're going to open that in a new tab. It requires a qualification. I may have already done that one. So we're going to go back. Oh. Go back to Reddit. We're going to go back and look for a different one. Okay, so, and people are super duper helpful on Reddit. It's insane. Everybody's so nice. So, I'm going to accept this. It's only five cents, but it should be worth it. It's 10 seconds. So, do, 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 do. again, you want to hard click and then open a new tab. Okay, and then on this, usually you can just click down on it and hit copy. And it will, so there was five cents. It's not the best paying survey, but, you know, whatever. So, then we're going to just hit submit. And that's going to submit. Submit that, girl. Okay, so that's it. So, we can go back and close this out. So you need to make sure that if you're on a survey page, that if there's a button uh, down at the bottom that says next or is a little arrow, you need to press it or it's not going to register your uh, your participation in it. So we'll go back and see if we can find one more. Uh, website click test 25. Okay, so we are going to open this, hard click, open a new tab. And again, when you have a little bit faster internet, so there's no more of these hits available and you can't do anything else with that. So just go back to Reddit and back. Okay, so what I saw like about this is it's going to tell you like a lot of stuff and the qualifications for it. So you have to be in the USA to do this one. So location equal to US. So if you don't live in the US, you can't do this one. So we're just going to do one more. There's no more of those hits. Uh, so for people that are just starting out on Reddit, uh, not Reddit, on MTurk, you're going to be able to get a lot more of these because I've been doing it so long. I've already done so many uh, surveys from different requesters that I can't do anymore. I don't have a master's. Okay, so we're going to try this one. And that one's gone. So this should work a lot better for you again because I've done so many of the surveys. But you just you need to utilize these three things. So you need to always have a tab open to Turk Opticon. Make a little make a little account, no big deal. You need to always have a tab open to your MTurk. Uh, and also some of the surveys are gonna ask for you to put in your worker ID, and all you need to do is click there and it's gonna copy it to your clip clipboard. 
So now that it's copied to my clip clipboard, I'm going to show y'all how to um, I'm gonna write a comment. So then you just hard press and you can find it on your clipboard. So that's my worker ID. It's super easy. I take a lot of screenshots of crazy people. Sorry. Okay, so that's it. So again, you just have open Turk Opticon, have open MTurk, and have open uh, Reddit His Worth Turkin 4. I hope that helped you guys. If you have any questions, I have an email down there. You can email me or look up some stuff on Reddit.com.